Hey guys, it's Josh and Serena from Our Story So Far. We were tagged in a video. We're here to do the tag that um, Sarah from Sarah Sneak on YouTube, youtube.com slash Sarah Sneak. She's calling it the Sexy Beast tag video. Let's go along with that and call it the Sexy Beast tag video. I like Sexy Beast. Um, since there's two of us, you're going to get like double the answer, so we're going to try to make it go as quickly as possible. Question number one. What are the three things about you that we wouldn't know by looking at you? I can juggle. I am obsessed with John Mayer. And I have an extreme horrible nail biting. Thing. Mine is, I'm a twin, though we look nothing alike. I have really big feet. They're really kind of big. They're not that big. <laughs> I chew really loudly, according <gasps> to him. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> what are three books you would recommend to a friend? The whole Harry Potter series. <laughs> that's seven books, but that's just one of them. Then, The Perks of Being a Wallflower, and To Kill a Mockingbird, because that's such a good book. The $100 Startup book. It's a good book. The Secret, because it's freaking amazing, like, to get positivity and you're like, oh. check it out, it's amazing. And I know this is going to sound crazy, the Twilight books. They're a lot better than movies, except you get to see cool art pets in the movies, but like, I read all the books. I know it sounds crazy, but I did. <laughs> it's like we're like fighting Harry Potter versus Twilight. Go Harry Potter. What are your three favorite movies? Back to the Future Part 2, <laughs> Rounders, and super bad. Those are my three favorite movies of all time. They love, change depending on the week. I love how it's just only two. Back to the Future 2. All the Back to the Future movies are great. Those two, one, three. So if I had to pick one, two. <laughs> Mine aren't all the Harry Potter movies, of course. <laughs> <laughs> the perks of being a wallflower in the movie form because the movie was just so good. Emma Watson, such a good actress. And Moulin Rouge. Oh. And you made me watch that, but it was that's good. That's such a good movie. But you made me watch it. It yeah. was good, though. What are your three favorite all-time or current television shows? All-time The Office, back when it was really good in the first few seasons. That show, you could not beat that show. Parks and Rec and 30 Rock, of course. It's like I watch a lot of NBC. I know. I can't help that it. That are all, like, gone. I, I know. <laughs> so sad. The Mentalist. That's a good show. Shark Tank. Everwood for back in the day, a few people were like WB fans and the WB with the frog and all that. That was back then. I'm gonna shout out to the Gilmore Girls because they were on WB too and that was such a good show. Um, what are the last three text messages you sent or received? I will start it off. I sent Serena a picture of this picture, Ryan Gosling and a husky, and it says, <laughs> hey girl, I don't mind if you're a little husky. I love you no matter what. And then the husky goes, swoon. <laughs> I sent her that picture. I sent a picture to my best friend saying it's a win-win situation. We are talking about what would happen if you took a poop in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> and I sent my sister showing him how to read notifications from Facebook. Ha ha ha. Because that's when we are trying to teach my dad how to use Facebook. I sent my brother a text asking him what his thing is for the Simpsons game I keep playing on my phone. So I need to find him so we can become friends on that game. Then I sent my sister a text message asking her the same thing. And if she wants us to stop by on Friday. The third one is a email, I mean a text message I get from my school, like with just like certain different things and they're having an alumni speaker come and speak on this one day, which I probably won't go do. Sounds interesting. Mm -hmm. What are the last three tweets or Facebook status updates? We'll do Twitter. What are the yeah. last three status updates you did? Okay, the last one was I posted a, a thing of me from Vine because I just got my hair done. So if you're not following me on Vine, you should go follow me on Vine. I posted in my Instagram picture. It was today was soft. It was our photo a day, so I took a picture of Angel Soft toilet paper, <laughs> and then I did a retweet of Cassie Ho, the girl that does blog lotties. And slow progress is much better than no progress. Go go go. My last three were at the hairstylist place with It's Serena C to get her new hairstyle. I find ways to entertain myself. And it was uh, this picture of me with my hair, with not my hair, getting underneath the hair washer thing. There was another one last night that I posted from Joe's Daily doing a giveaway on his channel for a t-shirt. So I posted that to try to win the thing. <laughs> try to win some free stuff. Yep. I posted a super pump for our LA VidCon Vegas trip where I made a countdown and then I tagged Serena and then our friend Caitlin in it because they're coming with it. Well, you're definitely coming with it. But she's coming with Yeah, so all that. That was my three last status updates from me. Who do you think are the three hottest celebrities already? <sighs> Jennifer Lawrence, boom shakalaka, right there. Boom, Emma Stone, boom shakalaka. Inspired this hair design from her. Yeah. I was, couldn't be more happy when she sent me the picture. She's like, I'm gonna get my hair done like Emma Stone. And I was like, I'm gonna be awesome dating Emma Stone. <laughs> um, Mila Kunis. What are you gonna do to look like Ryan Gosling? 
<laughs> my, my number one is Ryan Gosling. Hey girls. Swoon. Oh, I love those hey girls. Oh god, they're so good. Oh, Channing Tatum. Cause boy, look at that body. And then number three was, oh, it's going old school. Leonardo DiCaprio. Because no matter how old he gets, he will always make me swoon. What are three of your bad habits? I chew really loudly. <laughs> now you know that, and now you know it's really that bad. I really don't have a lot of patience for some things sometimes. She gets fed up and quits. And, and number three, I would think that if I don't get my way, I really throw a tantrum. Yeah. So basically I'm like a five-year-old that chews really loudly. <laughs> I also don't have any patience. I have a anger management like thing where like, especially with my family members, like my mom, I just like blow up. I'm just like, ah! like that. And you're then, not that bad. Yeah, inside you are inside more, like, you're more turmoil. And I like talking like, to my breath, getting angry. Yeah. yeah. And then biting my nail. My nails biting is really bad. Like it's like disgusting. It is gross. What are three specific foods you love? Salmon. I'm obsessed with salmon nowadays. It's ridiculous. Cereal, more specifically Raisin Bran Crunch. We'll go with blueberry muffins. I'm gonna bring that back because I could really go for a blueberry, <laughs> blueberry muffin. muffins. I forgot. Okay, so mine are egg whites. I eat them every morning. Anything that has to do with a potato, like <laughs> mashed potatoes, baked potatoes, fries. You're like sweet, bubblegum's oh, friend of even shrimp the, but of potatoes. Even the sweet potatoes, like just everything that potato, sweet potato, I will eat that all. Third one would have to be like, I'm gonna go with the salmon with you. I know, we're obsessed we're with salmon like, lately. We're really on a salmon kick. It's delicious. What are three words you hate? Any racial slur, but I think we both can agree on that one. Yeah. Like, there's just no need for it. Asbestos, which we both kind of agree on that one because it's hard. I can't believe I just pronounced it now because I, I usually say asbestos. I know. Asbestos? Yeah. Asbestos? There we go. Yeah, but she couldn't think of a third one. So I came up with my third one, which was the word ketchup because I hate everything that that product represents. Yeah. Everything ketchup represents, even the word, I hate you. I'm going to get some, I'm going to do some other turn. I'm going to do, I'm going to go with, Words that you don't want to hear while you're eating, like vaginal mesh. There's always a commercial on TV oh, that, yeah. that always is talking about that while I'm eating, and I don't want to hear that word. What are the first three things you see in front of you right now? Um, the Daniel Negreanu and Doyle Brunson poker player poker books that are like this thick holding you up right now. There's a tripod in the corner, which isn't used for this camera because this camera's too heavy for that tripod. And then my ridiculous DVD collection that is sitting there. But right now, as soon as I'm focused on my Mr. Bean collection from the BBC thing with him on that, that over in the UK, that's what's in front of me. Um, that Tostitos bag over there that <laughs> has like very small amount of chips, but I won't throw it away because I'm probably gonna eat them later tonight. My shoes, because they're on the floor and they're really comfortable. I just like my little dumbbells and my little Blagalotti's calendar that I used to work out with. Yeah. This is the third time <laughs> that we filmed and had to stop because the camera keeps shutting off. You I... guys won't, don't notice it. Just don't <laughs> notice it. All right, quickly, three biggest fears. Snakes. Snakes as well. I had a nightmare last night about a bit, very big snake. I can't even say it because the thoughts of that big snake is still creeping me today. Number two, being buried alive. Mine's being burned alive. <laughs> Not good. Number three, um, being in a horrible car accident. And mine is spiders, where both of us have had situations of like spiders in the car and you have to that kill them. That may have caused a car accident. No. Yeah, so it's like, I'm terrified of spiders. <laughs> ah, kill the spider. And like yeah. swerving us and it's like, ah, car accident. We're going yeah. to die. <laughs> Who are your three favorite YouTubers? Um, number one, Michael Buckley. But not just like What the Buck channel, like his regular channel. Everything. His, like Twitter, like all the stuff that he does on Connect TV, like yeah. just him all as one. Just Super everything he does, nice bold and guy. Done. Number two would have to be Charles and Ally and CTFXD and, and everything that they do too. Everything in between all yeah, of that. Yeah, everything that they do and Charles's channel, Ally's channel with her like Ask Ally and cinema and, that we do that we participate yeah, in. And their vlogs with the dogs. Yeah. Oh. It's so good. They're like the nicest people ever. Yeah. And then third is kind of a wild card that maybe you guys would may or know. may know. Yeah. Is Coffee Chat. It's Shannon Coffee and her YouTube name, youtube.com slash coffee chat. And it's so funny, like we found I found her like a few months ago when we were watching Daily Grace and then saw Daily Grace as part of my damn channel. I was like, what the heck is my damn channel? Looked at my damn channel, I was like, there's other people on here that make videos. Who are these people? And then I looked and like Shannon Coffee is like the channel was like just kinda yeah. starting and she's so funny. Yeah, she is. And it's like sometimes she'll do videos with her boyfriend Rob, who is also like they're both like that kind of like weird, awkward, but like really freaking like dry kind of humor sometimes yeah. and it's just funny like them and they're both together. really nice like the third for like kind of going with coffee like that you may not know you, that, 
that you may know. Damn, Mallow610 yeah. on YouTube. Um, he is so funny. He cracks it, but not even like, like he's another one like not just his like YouTube, but like his Twitter. He's just a funny person. He's yeah. hilarious. Opportunity bug. Opportunity bug. <laughs> so now this is the point where we tag other people. Yay. Um, which this is kind of the first time we ever done a tag video of like tagging other people, like things like this. So uh -huh. like we we're so we're just gonna stick with the threes. Number one is I'm gonna tag team on Sarah Sneak and tag Joe's Daily Talks as well. So since I was talking about Dan, we're gonna tag Dan. Yeah. Dan, you should do this. Totally do it. Yep, yeah, do it. Me and your then, boyfriend can do it. Yes. Do it. Yeah, that'd be nice, right? Third person we're gonna tag is somebody that we met through doing like the CTFX cinemas as well, like how we met Sarah Sneak is uh, the Reverend Gregory. I don't know if it's the Reverend Greg. The links will be in the description for all these people we've talked about. It's either the Reverend Greg or the Reverend Gregory. I think, I think it's think the Reverend Greg. Yeah, one of them, because one of them is just Twitter, one of them is that, but yeah, you'll know. find it. But he's like, he's a super he funny guy. And I think, hilarious. I think he would take, but also we're adding a bonus one. And yes. this is like kind of a, hey you, um, make, a get, make a video. Go ahead. Everyone else should make this video yeah. too. If, if you want to make, make a video, feel free to make it. it, do it, and post it as a video response. We know there's so. some people out there. Caitlin. Our friend who we talked about the count, I talked about the countdown going to our LA trip, Vegas, and VidCon thing. She, she's always wanted to make videos, but she always like feels like she needs a reason to. Well, now you should make this video. Do yes. this tag video. You can do it with Brad, too. Yes, and I think it'd be a great little introduction. Yeah, Because yeah. she watches YouTube videos and loves YouTubers a lot. But she wants to make a video. video. And you have a new camera, so make a new, make a video. Yeah, make a video. Make a video. You right there, and also you back there as well. Anybody back there, make a video. I uh, want other people to make this. I want. I, I want other people to do this video because I want to see the responses. I know. There were some really cool questions. Yeah. Very different. So I want to see awesome responses. So we'll see you guys next time. Yeah. Um, and have awesome days. I don't know. We don't know what we did. I didn't I think of this one through. Me neither. Bye. Bye.